Before jumping in your quad bike, give some thought to the task at hand. Is it really the right tool for the task? A quad bike incident can result in serious injury or even death, so don't assume your quad bike is the best tool for every task. Quad bikes can be prone to rollover or collision when traversing rough or sloping terrain, or when making emergency stops or turns. These issues are made worse when a quad bike is weighed down with heavy equipment or you're towing an attachment not designed to be used with your particular model. Plan your task and identify the safest equipment to use to complete it. When mustering cattle with a quad bike, you could be crossing rough terrain at speed or need to make tight turns to chase cattle. There is a high potential for a collision or rollover incident due to the terrain or rocks, logs and holes hidden in the long grass. The alternatives for mustering may be to use a horse, a motorbike or dogs. Using a quad bike to carry a large amount of equipment to do a task may not be the best option either. If you are erecting or repairing a fence, then perhaps carrying your equipment and workers in a ute or other vehicle is a better option. You will need to check the manufacturer's guidelines to assess whether your quad bike is suited to carrying heavy loads or towing attachments and that they're fitted correctly. Spraying weeds is another common task on properties, but towing a heavy attachment can pose a danger by increasing the instability of the quad bike. The weight from large volumes of liquid add to the potential for a quad bike to lose steering or braking control and may lead to a rollover, especially if the tank doesn't have baffles to stop the movement of liquid when the quad bike is turning or travelling across sloping ground. Even a small amount of liquid in a large tank will affect the stability of a quad bike. A better option may be to use a tractor or ute that has the capacity to carry a large volume of herbicide mix and which has a spraying rig. There will be times when using your quad bike is the best tool for the task. Whether you're inspecting fences, checking animals, spraying small areas, or doing other small maintenance tasks. At other times, a side-by-side -side tractor, ute, horse, or another vehicle may be better suited. Ultimately, you need to decide whether your quad bike is up to the task by assessing the risks. Other safety tips include wearing helmets, long sleeve shirts, gloves, boots, and eye goggles. Being trained in the use of quad bikes maintaining your quad bike to the manufacturer's specifications and checking the brakes and tire pressure daily, knowing your property terrain and not venturing into no-go zones. Develop a safety procedure for your property and make sure everyone follows it.